I'm Ryan Friedlinghaus. Welcome to another episode of West Coast Masters. Today, we're gonna show you how to change your oil. Behind me is a Jeep Cherokee. Today's technician is Jay. Jay, break it down. First step before you start working, make sure you have all the proper equipment and products. Definitely need oil, oil filter, oil filter wrench, and a drain pan. Make sure you have the proper tools and jack stands. First things first, open your hood and locate the oil filter. Every car is gonna be different, so make sure you find the correct oil filter. Then you gotta chalk the rear tires, jack up the car from the proper jack points. Once you have it jacked up, put it safely on jack stands and then lower down the car. From there, you wanna locate the drain plug. Prepare your oil drain pan and position it right below the drain plug. This might get a little messy, so be careful when you're removing the drain plug because oil may get on your hands. Loosen the plug, drain all the oil out. Once the oil is completely out, locate and unscrew the oil filter. Every filter is in a different position, so make sure you look for it and find the proper one. Once the oil is completely drained out and the filter is removed, clean and install the new oil filter. Sometimes you want to put a little bit of old oil on the filter to help it screw in properly. Then screw and tighten the drain plug. Once you have it completely tightened, from the top of the engine, locate the oil filler cap, remove it and fill the recommended oil. Depending on the engine, the car and the weight, the quartz may vary. Once you're done, check the dipstick for oil level and then close the oil filler cap. Lower your car down carefully and you're good to go. So there you have it. Hopefully that was simple enough so now you can change your own oil at home. Stay tuned for another episode of West Coast Masters.